In this video, I'm breaking balancing a tree on your dog's nose into five easy steps and I'm going to give you three different techniques to be able to teach it so that you can find the best fit for you and your dog. So, step number one is to keep your dog's head still. Now, there are three different techniques that you can use. One is focus. So you're gonna ask for your dog's eye contact and while he is looking at you, you're gonna mark and reward. The second technique is touch. If your dog is able to target your hand and go into touch, then this can be a really, really quick way of teaching this trick. Technique number three is my favorite. It worked so well with Aegon. It's called relax. The way that I use this technique is I put my hand beneath his chin and then with a treat, I lured his head down until my hand was actually taking the weight of his head. And then as soon as I was, took the weight of his head, I marked and rewarded him. When your dog is reliably keeping their head still, you can move on to step number two. Step number two is to ignore the hand. While your dog is in focus, touch or relax, you are going to start moving your hand towards their head until you can eventually touch their head with your hand while they keep their head still. If your dog does look away and actually try and look at your hand, then all you have to do is say, ah, ah no, and then just start again. Once your dog is completely ignoring your hand going towards their face and you're able to touch them, then you can move on to step number three. Step number three is introducing them to the object that you're gonna be balancing on their nose. A little tip is when Good your dog is boy. learning the principles of this trick, don't use a treat Good to balance boy. on their nose because this is far too distracting. Good job. Use something that the dog isn't gonna be interested in, like a water bottle lid. Step number four is desensitize your dog to the lid. While your dog is in focus, touch or relax, you're gonna start moving the lid towards the dog's face and you're gonna build it up until you can eventually place the lid on your dog's nose and hold it there for at least two seconds. Now, you are not going to let go of the lid right now. We don't want the dog to get spooked and we don't want him to move and for the lid to fall off. Right now, while he's learning the principle of balancing something on his nose, we want him to experience us just holding it there so he can learn how to stay still while there is something on his nose. If dog is keeping Good their head job. still while you're holding the lid on their nose, then you can move on to step number five. And step number five is of course, balancing the tree or object on your dog's nose. Now, well done if you were using focus and you managed to balance the tree or object on your dog's nose, but if you were using touch or relax, then of course you have one last thing left to do, and that is to move your hand away. Now, all you're gonna do is ask your dog to wait, and really slowly, you are gonna gradually move your hand away from the dog's face. And as soon as you are completely separated from the dog's face, you're gonna give it two seconds, and then you're gonna say, yes, good job, mark and reward. Dog's a genius, job done. So, that is how you balance a treat or an object on your dog's nose. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up, consider subscribing, and if there's a video that you'd like to see, jump into the comments below and let me know what it is that you wanna see. See ya. Zoom.